Hey, welcome to John's Detecting Adventures. Here we are, searching for history. My name's John M. Bradbury. Out trying to find history around this area where there's Saxon, Roman, medieval. And just a beautiful stream now, or part river, I think it is. Lovely built bridge. And we're going to follow the footpaths to find some history. Now, I'm with my friend. Michael. What do you think of this place then, Michael? Fantastic. I reckon we're in for a really good day here. This looks like really intriguing. As you say, John, Saxon, Roman, lots of old stuff and footpaths galore. So I'm following you, the master, today, and let's see what we can dig out history-wise. Fifty three. I can find fifty three. That's what we got here. I've got to dig it out then. Second World War bomber. Let's have a look. That's a cracking signal. Solid 21, that. That's a coin. Yeah. We've got it here then. Whatever this is. So it's in this muck then. What is it? Oh yes. Oh good. A coin. We have a coin. I'm not going to sell that. <laughs> you had a coin. <laughs> <laughs> well done. What a piece. I think it's uh, Elizabeth II, half penny, probably 1960s. He's got a solid target on his manticore, 2526 on mine. So let's just. Uh, Oh, 98 on mine. 98, I'm going to go back then, hang on. That's a silver number. You think so? Let's have a look here. Or oh, a big piece of tin. Or a big piece of tin, yeah. On this field, anything is possible. Go down. I do believe it's out. Mm. Can we have some good for a change? Cheer us up. Oh, it's not. It's crap. Oh dear. More tin. Okay, new hole. This was a 21 on the uh, on the um, 800. It's in the sod, and I never like it being in the sod, although I have had coins out of the sod before. So let's have a quick look and see what bit of the sod is left. Where we are. I'm not holding out a lot of hope for this now. <sighs> okay, so it's in this lump. Okay, here we go. Oh, there we are. Coin. Yeehaw. You can see the imprint of it on the clay there. I always like to make sure there's not more than... Uh, 
you can see that's a solid 25 26 on the uh, 800 I don't want to go sliding down the bank here though or lose whatever archaeological treasure is under here oh, let's have a look come around the other side of my hole there we are right let's get this sod out oh gosh I thought it was a giant post of some kind then oh well dear me it's in the sod so let's bring that over back to where I can work on it now how unusual I just said I don't like it being in the sod but there it was straight away pinpointer off let's have a look and see if I can tell you just double check that there's no more in here I don't think there is so it's a single coin okay can't really see right now what it is but we'll clean it up and take you a look later it's copper though there we go got a good signal here John a 25 or a 26 I think so let's gently ease this apart and do a double check as to which side of the sod we're on here we go Oh, that looks like an imprint of some kind there. Let's just break it up and have a look. Oh, sorry, my pinpoint is driving me wild. A little bit too near the surface for my liking here now, and that's why. There you go. Roman tin can. Twenty-five in that. Well, that is. That's a coin. Uh huh. Uh huh. Exactly. There's a coin. Wow. That's the old five pence. Large five pences, Elizabeth the second. We've got a hell of a tone on this, but again, I'm a little bit worried. Just come out of the ground. We're on uh, 25 solid, but then I lifted over the uh, the top, the 25 message on the uh, 800. Oop, let's turn the garret on. Right. And it's something right in the sod. Oh, hang on. What's this? There we are. Coin straight away, I think, unless it's a button. Let's have a look at it. Oop, just dropped it. There it is. Hang on. There we are. Coin itself. Let's have a look and see if I can tell you what it is. Looks a bit modern to me. Just have a look at this and see what you think. I'm on a 2422 here. Two pewter spoons over there. Hey? Oh. Yeah, exactly. Just have a look in there. 22, 24 on mine. Getting over what they're doing. Oh, yeah. Are you taking the grass up or is it just my eyes? I think it must be picking the grass up. They because they will have bailed it, won't they? They will have bailed it. Yeah, it's a good signal, but it's it's, it's like tin to me. But dig it, how are you? Nice signal. But it's a tin, tinny one to me. 23? Yeah, it's, it's, it's a good one. Could be, if that's silver, good. <sighs> so I'm zigzagging on here now. Okay. 
definitely still in the hole. It's oh, there we go. John was right. You can see it coming out of the hole. That's a large bit of metal hinge. Oh, hang on, let me show you. He was absolutely right. All right, this is quite a good signal on the 28. But having just found a couple of the old sheep dip things that vets seem to throw away in the fields, uh, it's a little shallow, so I'm a little worried about this. But we'll have a go and see what we find. Just, just turn the good old trusty carrot on. There it is. This is a piece of crap, I'm afraid. A large lump of crapiola. I have no idea what it is. But it's a lump of old useless stuff that we'll take out of the farm field. 52. Hmm. Yeah. Big brass screw. Not what we want. Brass department. Well, oh, 43. 70. Right, come on. I bet you a pound that's a bottle top. Yeah, yeah it sounds like it's like sound a bit croaky now. Sound a bit not right. Oh, there it is. Yes. Yes. The uh, evening festival of uh, Roman debauchery. Yes, definitely. I've just dug the hole, so. Just wanted to show you here, it doesn't look too deep. A solid 23. A couple of nice signals coming out of that. So let's lift the sod out and let's have a look. Oh, didn't say it was too deep. I'm frightened it was in the sod. And in which case I'm frightened it'll be. Yeah, it is. Nothing in the hole. Oh gosh. It may be another of those sheep dip things or sheep whatever they squirt on sheep, you know, it's like the bane of my life, that. Anyhow, let's have a look. Oh, hang on, yep. Yeah, it's somewhere near the top. Oh, I can see, oh, hang on. Wait a minute, hey, hey. Here we go. I think I've just found a pound. 
I have indeed. Elizabeth the second the second. Hey hey hey! I'm a pound better off. Seventy seven actually. A big note. <laughs> big note. Not what we want. Right, we got my stuff ready. Just had an 18 to 20 on this hole. Although where we are on this field, we found an awful lot of those sheep filler things. You know the uh, the stuff that. Here we go. Um, the stuff that just irritates everybody. Oh God, here's another one. I think. Yep, there we are. Another sheep tube filler. Going, oh, I don't know why they leave these all over the place. I'm getting a 2123. Let's go and have a look and see what we can find. We're quite near a couple of old footpaths, and this is on the way to an old pub. I've just had an old coin out that I filmed a moment ago, uh, and this is not too far away. Guess what? Lump of lead. Wow, and what a lump of lead that is. That's a monster lump of lead. I've just had a 27 on the 800. So I've dug the hole, you can see the hole there, and it's out, but, and there you are, you can see it, a 20, 25, 26, 27. So, let's have a look. Uh, there's been a lot of those sheep things on this field though, so I'm not holding out too much enthusiasm or optimism, but at least I dug the hole in the right place. Okay, so. Trusty Garrett on. Oh, there it is. There it is. Hey, hey, hey. Right here. I was just saying to John a few minutes ago, I've had very few coins out today. And he said, I hope you're filming the ones you've got. <laughs> so there we are. I wonder if it's George V. Can you see the heads looking the one way? Right, let me go and have a closer look. 55. Piece of tin. Well, I guess after a while, you're still learning your machine, right? And I don't know, because John's on the other side of the field, so I can't ask him about this, but here we are. This signal's all over the place. High-pitched, 35. No, then it goes to 5. You see, I'm worried now. 
So this is where I had that signal and it was in the sod. I'm getting a 27, 29 now. So what I like to do is I like to split the sod in half so I can see what's what. Where is it? Is it in that half? And the answer to that is no. Is it in this half? The answer to that is yes. It's somewhere in here. Let's go and have a look. Oh, there it is. Oops. And this is a wonderful bottle top. Quite an old one too, not a Roman one maybe. Oh well. Forty-four. Well, I think we've got it out that time. I think it's in there. There it is, forty-four in there, look. Aha, what's up then? Yeah, what's this in? Go button. <laughs> Go plated button. Oh, it's in his hand, all that. Go plated button. 33. Look at that. Big, some sort of chain reaction. <laughs> 33 83 Oh dear And I saw bottle top Hey, a coin. Sixty two. It's in the sod. What's that then? Trolley brass, brass bucket. Six there, sixteen is more. What's that then? Oh, you. Yeah. Uh, oh. So button. Silver plated button. Silver plated button. That's what we got there, silver plated button, probably 18th century. Oh yes, we've got one. We have an old kind. Jolly God. Who is it? Oh, Georgia fifth. Georgia fifth penny, half penny. Oh, that's really good. Ninety-two. Oh, what's that? <laughs> there you go. Size of that. Some sort of tank top type thing for the tractor. Massive. Big. That's probably the brass department. 